I'm Jerry Nettles. I had a double lung transplant at U.S. Health. Actually, the way I found out that I had the problem, me and my daughter was actually going to jog, and I just got tired. I mean, I got tired like I'd been running a marathon, and I told her something wrong. He came to us really in need for a lung transplant. So he underwent the full assessment, and, and we felt he would be a great candidate. When it gets to that point, uh, the patient is uh, very likely to die unless transplant is done. And his lung was being uh, uh, impacted in a way that his heart uh, had a hard time working. I got a call in 2016 in August, and me and my wife was in the bed, but we didn't hear the call. And they actually called us 17 times. But I talked to the doctor, he said, you missed out on a lung. He was uh, so sick, I was afraid that uh, if he would have had to wait uh, any longer, uh, he could have died waiting on the transplant list. Maybe the lungs that we didn't get was better off for somebody else than me. That's why I looked at it. I ended up having surgery on March 24th of 2017, and it was a, a lengthy process. It was scheduled six and a half hours, but it went nine and a half. When our procurement team arrived at the donor hostel, they identified some issues with the donor lungs. And at that moment, we elected to proceed with what's called ex vivo lung perfusion. So this is an innovative technology that we have available and is basically bringing the donor lungs to our site and then placing them on a device that is going to perfuse and ventilate the lungs and, and hopefully make them better. That's where Dr. Machuk and I interacted and, and felt that that was the next step. After using the XP, well, we saw that the lung and the oxygenation and the chest radiograph was getting better and better to a point that we were able to move with the transplant. It was, it was rough, you know, your family sitting there waiting on you, you know, to know that you're going to live or go into the next world. And I, I lived because of your health. Mr. Nettles is uh, doing great. Uh, we know he's passing for cars and able to go back and enjoy with his cars. Uh, it's uh, wonderful. My experience at UF Health gave me life. Because as long as I can wake up, I got a chance. And the, at UF Health, they gave me that chance. I treat everybody as family. Because when you got a family that loves you and take care of you, blood ain't got nothing to do with it. You know, it's color ain't got nothing to do with it because I love everybody. And UF Health is my family.